molecules are the fundamental building blocks of all matter, they are the smallest units of a substance that still retain its chemical properties. A molecule is composed of two or more atoms that are held together by a chemical bond. The bond between atoms can be covalent, ionic, or metallic depending on the type of atoms involved. Molecules come in different shapes, sizes, and properties. Some molecules are simple, consisting of just a few atoms, while others are incredibly complex and composed of thousands of atoms. For example, a water molecule, which is one of the simplest molecules, is composed of just three atoms, two hydrogen atoms and one oxygen atom. In contrast, a protein molecule, one of the most complex molecules, can contain thousands of atoms. Molecules are incredibly important in many aspects of our lives. For instance, they play a crucial role in the functioning of the human body, from the structure and function of proteins and DNA to the regulation of hormones and neurotransmitters. Molecules also play a crucial role in the natural world, from the photosynthesis of plants to the chemical reactions that occur in the atmosphere. The study of molecules is a vast field known as molecular chemistry. This field involves the study of the properties, structure, and behavior of molecules including their interactions with other molecules and the environment. Molecular chemistry is critical to many areas of science, including biochemistry, pharmacology, and materials science. In summary, molecules are the fundamental units of matter, composed of two or more atoms held together by a chemical bond. They come in different shapes and sizes, and their properties play a crucial role in many aspects of our lives from the functioning of the human body to the natural world. The study of molecules is a vast field, with important applications in many areas of science. The discovery of molecules can be traced back to the late 18th century when chemists began to study the properties of gases. In 1787, Ongdwan Lavoisier and Joseph Priestley independently discovered the existence of oxygen gas, and by the end of the century, Scientists had discovered many other gases, such as nitrogen, hydrogen, and carbon dioxide. In the early 19th century, John Dalton proposed the atomic theory of matter, which suggested that all matter was composed of tiny, indivisible particles called atoms. However, it wasn't until the mid-19th century that chemists began to realize that atoms could combine to form larger units called molecules. One of the first chemists to recognize the existence of molecules was Amdeo Avogadro, who proposed in 1811 that equal volumes of gases at the same temperature and pressure contained the same number of molecules, regardless of their chemical composition. This became known as Avogadro's law and was instrumental in the development of the concept of the mole, which is a unit of measurement used in chemistry to express the amount of a substance. The characteristics of molecules depend on their composition and structure. Molecules can be composed of atoms of the same element, such as the oxygen molecule, O2, or the nitrogen molecule, N2, or they can be composed of atoms of different elements, such as the water molecule, H2O, or the carbon dioxide molecule, CO2. The structure of molecule determines its properties such as its shape, polarity, and reactivity. Molecules can have different shapes, such as linear, bent, or tetrahedral, depending on the arrangement of the atoms in the molecule. Polarity refers to the distribution of electric charge in a molecule, which can make it either polar or nonpolar. This property can influence the solubility of a molecule in different solvents and its ability to interact with other polar or nonpolar molecules. Molecules can also be reactive, meaning they can undergo chemical reactions with other molecules or compounds. Chemical reactions involve the breaking and forming of chemical bonds between atoms in a molecule, which can result in the formation of new molecules with different properties. In conclusion, the discovery of molecules was a gradual process that began with the study of gases in the late 18th century and culminated in the recognition of the concept of the molecule in the mid-19th century.
The characteristics of molecules depend on their composition and structure, including their shape, polarity, and reactivity, and are critical to understanding their properties and behavior in different chemical and biological contexts. The structure of a molecule refers to the arrangement of its constituent atoms in space. The structure of a molecule plays a crucial role in determining its physical and chemical properties, including its shape polarity, and reactivity. Molecules can have different structures, including linear, bent, and tetrahedral, depending on the arrangement of their atoms. The arrangement of atoms is determined by the number of valence electrons in the constituent atoms and the nature of the chemical bonds between them. The valence electrons are the electrons in the outermost energy level of an atom, and they are responsible for forming chemical bonds with other atoms. In general, atoms will form chemical bonds with other atoms in such a way as to achieve a stable electron configuration, usually one in which the outermost energy level is either full or contains eight electrons. The nature of the chemical bond between atoms in a molecule determines the structure of the molecule. There are three types of chemical bonds, covalent, ionic, and metallic. In covalent bonds, two atoms share electrons, while in ionic bonds, one atom donates electrons to another atom. In metallic bonds, electrons are shared among a group of atoms. The structure of a molecule is often described using Lewis structures, which show the arrangement of electrons in the molecule. Lewis structures are useful for predicting the shape of a molecule, as well as its polarity and reactivity. The shape of a molecule is determined by the positions of the atoms in space and it can have a significant impact on the molecule's properties. For example, the shape of a protein molecule determines its ability to bind to other molecules, while the shape of a drug molecule can determine its effectiveness in treating a particular disease. In summary, the structure of a molecule refers to the arrangement of its constituent atoms in space and plays a crucial role in determining its physical and chemical properties. The structure of a molecule is determined by the number of valence electrons in the constituent atoms and the nature of the chemical bonds between them. The shape of a molecule can have a significant impact on its properties, and it is often described using Lewis structures. Molecules exhibit a wide range of physical and chemical properties that are determined by their composition and structure. These properties include molecular weight. The molecular weight of a molecule is the sum of the atomic weights of all the atoms in the molecule. It is a measure of the mass of the molecule and can influence its physical properties, such as its melting and boiling points, as well as its reactivity. Solubility The solubility of a molecule refers to its ability to dissolve in a particular solvent. Solubility is determined by the polarity and size of the molecule, as well as the nature of the solvent. Polar molecules tend to be more soluble in polar solvents, while nonpolar molecules tend to be more soluble in nonpolar solvents. Polarity The polarity of a molecule refers to the distribution of electric charge within the molecule. It is determined by the electronegativity difference between the atoms in the molecule and can influence the molecule's physical and chemical properties, such as its boiling point, melting point, and reactivity. Polar molecules have a positive and negative end, while nonpolar molecules have a more even distribution of charge. Reactivity Molecules can undergo chemical reactions with other molecules or compounds. The reactivity of a molecule depends on its chemical structure and the nature of the chemical bonds within the molecule. Some molecules are highly reactive, while others are relatively inert. Acidity and basicity some molecules can act as acids or bases, depending on their chemical structure. Acids donate protons, H+, in a chemical reaction, while bases accept protons. The acidity or basicity of a molecule can influence its reactivity and its interactions with other molecules. Melting and boiling points The melting and boiling points of a molecule are determined by its intermolecular forces which are the attractive forces between molecules. 
The strength of these forces depends on the polarity and size of the molecule and can influence its physical properties. Biological activity, molecules can interact with biological systems, including enzymes, receptors, and other proteins. The biological activity of a molecule depends on its chemical structure and the nature of its interactions with these biological systems. In summary, molecules exhibit a wide range of physical and chemical properties that are determined by their composition and structure. These properties include molecular weight, solubility, polarity, reactivity, acidity and basicity, melting and boiling points, and biological activity. Understanding these properties is essential for predicting the behavior of molecules in different chemical and biological contexts.